Hey YouTubers, this video today is going to be a little bit different down here in the woods and it's kind of a cold day and I have a hard time getting started on these cold mornings. Uh, stand here by this old tree, I wanted to show that to you. This is an old blackjack, it's probably over 100 years old. This is one of the original trees I would expect from the uh, what's called the Cross Timbers Forest in central Oklahoma. Uh, back when I was uh, racing dirt bikes over to east of here is a place called Draper Lake where we used to ride and there's a lot of old oaks over there and it's uh, that's why we call it the uh, Cross Timbers Enduro when we had our motorcycle race over there because the old original Cross Timbers Forest. This is one of those trees. See it's seen better days. We've had a couple of ice storms here and uh, some tornadoes across uh, my property right across here there's a bunch of big trees laying down in there that look about like this with suckers coming up out of them and trying to clean those up so this video today I'm going to uh, do a time lapse I saw some other youtubers playing around with time lapses on uh, some GoPros and things like that a guy named Big O so he has some pretty cool time lapses you might check that out or he goes by time lapse time-lapse man when he does his time lapses uh, there in Tennessee some are pretty neat uh, so I got this nasty brushy area here that uh, I've been trying to clean up and I'll give you a close-up of that so I'm gonna do a time-lapse of that I'm gonna get me a fire started over there so I can burn this stuff as I pull it out and I'll load it in the tractor and, and dump it into the fire pit and get it going so with that we'll get started <music> So looking back from the pond there, you can see how I've cleared this out in here. That took me about a day to do all of that. And this part right here is what I'm going to do today. So you can see, that's what it looked like before. And I'm going to go all the way to about right in there. Cleaning that out, I'll leave a few of the smaller trees to fill in behind elms that die out but uh, that's the plan let's get started That fescue that we seeded is starting to come in. Come in pretty good. Well, before we use the tractor, we gotta empty out the bucket. It's got a bunch of dirt in there from when I was digging around the trees
Okay, you can see I got my time lapse camera going here. This is a Tanaka Weed Eater TBC 270PN. This is a commercial grade weed eater and I got the saw blade on it. It's kind of dull, I need to sharpen it, but you want to talk about dangerous, this sucker's dangerous, you got to really be careful with it. But uh, you can cut off a tree that's about probably inch, inch and a half in diameter just swiping it with this saw. It's pretty good for clearing brush. Poor man's GoPro.
obviously dead. Hanging on this other dead one right there. notch it right here and so it can fall this way hopefully not on me Things are everywhere. I hate them. Don't you think if these things were around when they made the movie Texas Chainsaw Massacre, these would have been a lot scarier. Do a lot more damage with that. Well, we put a good dent in it anyway. Didn't quite get done. Just got this little bit right in here to do. And uh, it'll be to this big washout here. And then that'll be the end of it. So, quite a bit of work still, but got a lot done. Time to clean up. Well, folks, I've ever quit. My battery is almost dead. Got a lot of footage, so it's going to be a lot of editing to make this a short enough video to be interesting. So, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll catch you on the next video.